I think the three of us agree, you know, atheism kind of gets you to square one because it kind of removes an illicit source of belief. But of course, atheism by itself just is the absence of a belief. It doesn't, right. isn't a right. positive commitment to what we ought to no. uh, strive for. And that's why I, I think, and I assume that you, you both of you agree that that humanism, enlightenment values have to uh, are are essential in saying that if you're an atheist, it doesn't mean you don't believe in anything. Right. There really is a totally coherent, defensible system of morality uh, that just doesn't require God as the enforcer or as the dictator. Namely, uh, we are we ought to maximize human well-being, life, health, education, happiness, freedom. Uh, this is it's not that that's not nothing. Uh, yeah. and, and what I try to argue in, in Enlightenment now is that the, uh, the attempt to prioritize human well-being is, I mean, I don't want to say it succeeded because a lot of the world is still in misery, but the world is really better off than it used to be as a result of our, uh, at least implicitly, putting those values as our, um, uh, as our moral bedrock. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.